Um, will 1.0 update improve the, or release, I guess, uh, will improve the current limits on uh, the max items? Uh, for instance, big saves you often need manual intervention, blah, blah, blah. So they're talking about the uh, U object limit that we have in the game. Mm -hmm. um, there's actually, by the way, fun fact, I didn't know this until recently. Somebody made a mod that displays like all the the U objects that's currently loaded in game. Ooh. I don't know if that actually is accurate, but I think it's a good indication at least, because as far as I knew, there wasn't like a good way to get a good state of the garbage collector in Unreal Engine and be able to like actually count them out like that. Uh, you know when you hit the limit. Um, mm. But I think it's a good indication at least. Um, for people that are building like maniacs uh, to see <laughs> how far they are. And also, okay. I think it's also fun to look at that and see like when you're placing stuff, just like how different things affect that U object count because it's not linear and it's very different depending on uh, like what you're building, like what actually counts for it. But we have made improvements. We actually have, this is also, oh, I need to put this down. This is also might be a really interesting video. We have made a huge uh, change to, to, uh, um, to some of the rendering systems for rendering the cosmetic stuff, like the foundation pieces and the stuff that's not moving. Uh, what the hell's that system called again? Uh, render. Um, <clears throat> so yeah, there's actually been a lot of improvement in that regard. Um, I don't remember. Outside of that system, there's also a bunch of new things I think that we haven't included in update eight. So yeah, it should be better. But the problem is we're never gonna, it's, it, there's always gonna be a limit. So uh, we can just like reduce, you know, the waiting time <laughs> until you hit that limit. 